Hello, Brandon Tooth and Moon, and welcome to my channel. I have another witchy unboxing for you for March. It's the Witch's Moon. It's our usual pretty box with all the symbols all the way around. I don't ever remember the theme, so we're going to find out now. This is how pretty it looks when I open it. Let's get to it. Let's see if I can get this a little better on the box. There we go. So, we got our twine paper. And our theme is, oh, the Spell Crafter Collection. The Spell Crafter Collection. So, this could be anything exciting. All right, so our Oracle card this month is a round one. A base chakra blessing for soul vitality and stoic foundations that support the manifestation of my heart's true beauty for the highest good. So that's my oracle, and that is the backing of it. And we have, it looks like here, looks like a sigil. And of course, a book of shadow sheet. For here now, within and without, the circle cast on um, sacred ground. It's a perfect little north, south, east, and west. Oh, elementaries. I call about so mode it be. So, as above, so below. Book of shadow sheet. My kitty cat is knocking on the door with her little claws. So, let me let her in. Come on in. I know you're crying. Come on. They haven't been in here in a few days. I know. I know, baby. Okay. Our Book of Shadows sheet is called The Enchanting the Stone. Enchanting the Stone. To clear stones, to charge. Always beautiful. And we have one, two, and this is the third. Days of the week. Days of the week. So to do spells, they give you here, which this is what I go by, like certain days. On Friday, I would do love spells, so forth. And, um, and then it goes for the chakras as well. Tuesdays, goes with the colors, moon, Mars, Mercury. Venus and the, uh, the God and Goddesses. As always, look how beautiful that is. It really is beautiful. So our Book of Shadows is this beautiful days of the week. Right on top, I can see what the big gift is. You see it? But I'll pull that last. So the first thing we have is a bag, ooh, different, of little pieces of Lomarian quartz. Lomarian quartz. We have licorice root. Licorice root. And then our last, oh, no, there's more. We have chest berry. Ooh. Each has a different little label. It's cute. Chest berry. And then we have one that says fire. Ritual herbal blend for fire. stomach guys I, I'm sure you hear that then we got water ritual herbal blend um, we have a bag of sea salt I figured if we got water and fire we would get all of them but 
We got a lot going on here, so maybe they're still in there. Okay. We have our candle. Now, last month, my box came in broken. I don't even know if I did a video because it really came in. Everything was, like, smashed. But they did send it to me. Everything was perfect. But I don't know if I put the video up or not because I was looking for it. I think I might have accidentally deleted it, but I hope not. Because I don't like to miss any boxes. Ooh, we have a pretty, like, I'm going to call it like a, a pastel green beeswax candle. Mmm, they always smell delicious. Always smell delightful. <laughs> and we have a big, huge smudge stick here. Um, looks like it might be. It's very delicate. I don't know what this is. Maybe it's that yerba. I'm going to um, screw it up. It could be. This could be mountain sage, maybe. I don't know what this is. Mm. Um. Yeah, it's very delicate. Um. I don't know. Well, or it could be that, um, I don't think it's definitely not cedar. It's not rosemary. All right, we'll find out when I read the paper. We have Lady Luck Sacred Salts and a green packaging. And this is our sacred salt. A lot in here, too. They give you a lot of nice salt. All right, so our big item we see here is the Wikipedia spell deck. Now this is an older deck. This is not something new, but I don't think I have, I mean, I sell it at the store, but I don't think I personally have this. It looks really cool. Wikipedia spell deck, uh, over a hundred spells and ritual for the modern day witch. Maybe this is new to be a remake. Uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure. Um, also available Wikipedia, The Good Witch's Guide, The Witch's Way, Crystal Witch, Wikipedia Journal, and The Good Witch Planner. Um, this is really cool. I mean, who couldn't use this in their craft? What are you doing, baby? So I'll open up and look at a little bit of this. That's cute. And this is a value of... $26.99 right there. And we have a couple more items. We have a moon incense burner, a wooden one. We have our incense sticks, which are patchouli. We have, we even have a spray this month. Our spray is, doo -doo 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 -doo. let's see, I ripped it a little bit, so it's going to take me a minute to figure out where I did that. Okay, here we go. Money, no? Manifest. Sometimes it's hard for me to read the font. Manifest spray. Came from a spread bottle. And the last item in our box looks like a green adventuring stone for money and abundance for the month of March. Nice big honk. And that's the box. And we, yeah, it's weird that we didn't get the, um, maybe we're going to get it next month. We got water and fire. I don't understand why we wouldn't get all the elements, but. I never do know. And you will find out when I read this. All right, the Spellcrafter Collection. There comes a time in our lives where we must work diligently to inspire change and movement within our environment. This can be due to stagnation, feeling stuck, feeling hopelessness, 
feeling drained. Through the practice of working with natural elements, we are able to rely upon the energies of our craft to pick ourselves up, helping us walk confidently through any challenges that may arise. In addition, we are able to create real value in everyday, every mundane experience. In this extremely exciting collection, we provide a large variety of tools to reignite the internal flame through crafting, creating, and spell work. The intention placed within the collection is truly abundant, formed to help in crafting the world that surrounds you for the benefit of all. For here and now, within and without, the circle casts on sacred ground of north, east, south, and west. Oh, elementaries, I call about, so mote it be. The magical items in this box are as follows, and it starts with the deck. So let me open that. And I'll start reading it once I get this plastic open a little bit. All right, Wikipedia spell deck. A hundred spells and rituals for the modern day witch by Sean Robbins, Leanna Greenway, and Charity Beldell. Sean Robbins is an author and co-author of five books, including The Good Witch, The Wikipedia, The Witch's Way, and Crystal Witch. She has taught at New York School of Occult Arts and lectures extensively. Leanna Greenway is a co-author of numerous books and was a columnist occult arts um, for UK Fate and Fortune magazine. And then Charity Bedell, also known as Luna Wind, has been practicing witch for over 15 years and has an extensive knowledge in herbal medicine and magic. To use the spell deck, please, you see the following. Wicca is an open-minded faith that can be fine-tuned to suit your needs. You can practice lightly or immerse yourself completely. Spells and petitions are prayers with actions taken, such as inscribing a candle, tying knots, and so on. To obtain your desire, if parts of the spell don't ring true to your soul, simply eliminate those parts and find appropriate find approaches you more are comfortable with. There's no right or wrong way, just as long as you keep in mind that witches work with the good of humankind and never set out to harm others. All right, so when I open it up, we have the sun on both sides. We have oops, a little Wicca spell deck book, and it seems to open up like this. So we got a lot of info here. And on this side as well. And then we're looking at a lot of cards here. Let's save it. So they're very pretty. It starts with the Sabbaths. We have... Sabbaths, Pets in Nature. We have Spirituality, and the cards change. Oops, I'm knocking things over. This one has a Witch on a Moon. Money and Career. So they're all family. So each in the back have self-care. This is cool. Cleanse and purity. So these are just some of them. Protection, love, and so forth. So this is what it looks like. So this one says find love. This one's for love. Find true love. Goes over materials, ritual. And there's little codes up here that you can find out in the book what they mean. And then you have another, this is like another love one. And they all have different pictures, which is cool. So they're little different spell cards. These are really cool. Like I said, they have lots in here. Cleanse your spirit, say goodbye to stress, self-care, family, money, career, spirituality. So then you got the Sabbaths, what's nice. You got the Salon spell, ritual. 
Evo Star are coming up, so. Ostara, they have this one. Remove obstacles on Ostara. So that is really an awesome. I like this. This is really cool. I'm glad I got one. I'm going to have fun going through all these. Very cool. Very nice. All right. So, Enchanting a Stone Book of Shadows reference artwork. Enchanting a Stone. Oh, yes. Which is this guy here. Um, by A.E. Alden as well. And then we have the exclusive days of the week correspondence book of shadows artwork they call it by A. E. Alden as well. So it'll help you prepare, you know, and plan your spell crafting. Um, green adventuring stone, and this is for known to enhance the zest for life. Vitality, confidence, unbound growth, in addition, combines the energies of both water and earth, supporting the balance of emotion and physical changes. Um, this is also good for abundance and prosperity. Magic. Okay, bag of small quartz. Oh, that was in the beginning. Here we go. As stated within the uh, Wicca spellbook, crystals possess a pure natural magic. They can absorb energies around them. So need to be cleansed before use and then once a month to keep them fresh. These small quartz are a perfect size to include within a variety of elixirs and magical pouches. And then we got the Elementary Calling Book of Shadows artwork, which is this. To place upon your altar, we have created a small incantation and sigil art print. It's intended to say out loud or sung during preparation. The sigils you will find within the orbis represent the elements and cardinal directions by A.E. Alden. Oh, wait. No, this is written by, sorry. G. Ibis. G. Ibis. All right, kitty, I'm coming. Really? Now you're going to wreck my joint. Come on. Let's go. You can go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Chip, 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 chip. Come on. Let's go. In and out. In and out she goes. Then we got the hand rolled beeswax candle in this beautiful green with pure intention so that you may use it as you see fit. Generally, green spell candles are used for following, managing wealth and money, nature and garden spells, success and achievement. Before you begin, work to create the energy that you intend to surround you during ritual. It can be, this can include cleansing, cleaning, and setting the tone for the proposed, for the proposed ritual. All right, so, and that's what that's for. Um, oh, wow. This is wild lavender. This is called purple sage. A wonderful flowery lavender sage has been long used within ceremonial rituals, providing protection and banishing any negative influence that may quest for attack. Lavender brings peace and attracts higher frequencies. Then it goes into sea salt. Of course, it's going into stated within the Wikipedia. Salt is a fantastic source of protection, is used in many spells to banish anything evil. Either sprinkle a little salt over your altar cloth or put some on the altar in a small bowl. And then it goes into the no chest berries. Chest, 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 chest. 
these are right here and this is commonly used in celebration of divine and feminine mysteries honoring the goddess demeter and persephone which is good because this is the month for persephone and demeter perfect licorice root we have a wonderful fragrant root must have in which is herbal cabinet to promote love passion a true companion for attraction and fidelity magic fire and water herbal blend so they start with the fire and they're saying to promote the influence of fire energy this blend has been created to following with the following herbs mustard seed orange peel angelica root black peppercorn and cloves and then we got the water ritual herb to promote the influence of course water this is blend has been created with the following herbs cinnamon hibiscus rabbit's berry leaf clats claw bark and catnip leaf so just those two this time then we got the lady luck ritual salts uh associated with the essence of energies of luck was created with the intention of enhancing your ability to attract opportunities to your path very cool. It's also enchanted with the sacred salt, basil, green tea oils, as well as basil, vervain, calendula herbs. And they mix stuff with their oil of Fortuna, Fortuna's Fold Magical Oil. And then patchouli incense. Is a relaxing and meditative energy surround you, traditionally used in enhancing luck and prosperity. Prosperity, and it's truly is a wonderful agent of positive transformation and manifestations. Then the wood incense holder. We are thrilled to include a wooden incense holder with this collection for you to burn associated incense. Then the person. Oracle card is from the Circle of Healings Affirmation Deck by Alana Fairchild. And then as always, they give you a blank sheet to add to your own book of shadows, make your own rituals. I thought this box was actually a very good box. Um, even though it's not like a personal item that they created... I think everything in here blends awesomely. And I, like I said, when I get something I don't have, I love it. This is like very exciting to go through. Lots and lots of spells. Don't take a lot of space. You don't need like a hundred different spell books. So that's great. And I like that they switch things up with herbal blends and more herbs. Oh, and I missed this. How did I miss the spell? Um, the spray. The spray, spray, spray. Oracle incense, all the ritual incense, six ladies, ritual herbal blend, rivers, just sea salt, extra oil. Manifestation, here it is. Manifestation, manifest ritual or spray. We are thrilled to be able to introduce our manifest ritual or spray within this special collection. Created with the intention of pushing your spells through to real manifestations. This spray is perfect companion during the months of transformation ahead. We recommend using this aura spray while resetting and singing and crafting or creating. We have created this aura spray with the oils of clove, cedarwood, polysanto, five finger grass, and a special mixture of some would it be magical oil from their personal cabinet. Make sure you shake well, blah, 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 three to four feet away and spray. Starting to lose. Very awesome. I, I am thrilled to this with this box. Like I said, I love everything in it. Let me know, guys, what you think about this month's Marches, which is Moonbox. I love it, and I can't wait to get the other ones to share with you guys. Thanks for watching.